please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Take action. Get a yearbook. Jump to get your yearbook. Climb to get your yearbook. Oh, oh shoot. Oh my god. Oh, Lorenzo, are you okay? Are you okay? Parkour to get the yearbook. Yearbooks are on sale now. Don't miss out. Get it on the James Monroe website jamesmonroe.aps.edu. The prices will go up. QSA updates. Hey there, Raptors. It's Miss Olson. I just wanted to give a quick update to my QSA kiddos. Next week, we're going to meet Wednesday at both A and B lunch instead of Friday. Okay, so Wednesday the 20th, come to B201 for QSA. Friday the 22nd is National Day of Silence, and I have a bunch of stuff to give you for that and things to talk about, so just be looking for that. Thanks, I hope you guys are doing well, and good luck with your testing. See you on Wednesday. This week, QSA will be on Wednesday, April 20th. National Day of Silence is on Friday, April 22nd, and it is meant to spread awareness to LGBTQ harassment and those lost to suicide. Students, spring testing will begin after spring break. Our school will be on a block schedule during testing, meaning you will alternate going to periods 1, 3, 5 on one day and periods 2, 4, 6 the next day. Classes will be 110 minutes on testing days. Students will take the language arts test the week of April 19th through the 22nd. There are two language arts tests. If you miss your scheduled testing day, you will be required to make it up. So please plan on being present and on time on your scheduled testing day. It is very important that you bring your charged Chromebook to school every day. You will take these tests on your Chromebook. It is your responsibility to bring this with you every day. You will also not be allowed to have cell phones, smartwatches, AirPods, or any wireless headphones, or any other electrical device or electronic device besides your Chromebook on testing days. This means that teachers will be checking your arm and ask you to remove your smartwatches to put them in your backpacks. Cell phones will need to be turned off and placed in your backpacks. These backpacks will be placed along the wall in your classroom so they are not next to you in the testing environment. Here is a website where you can take the practice test to help prepare yourself to do your best. This link is also on our school website. We encourage all students to do their very best on these tests. Thank you. Attention all 8th graders. Are you interested in attending the... 8th grade Enchanted Ball? If you are, you'll be happy to know. The dance will be on Friday, May 20th. It will be for 8th graders only. The ticket to get in is $5.
Hope to see you there, Raptors. Have a great day. Hey Raptors, welcome back to the JMMS Game Show. Here are my 6th, 7th, and 8th grader, and please state your names. Jeremy. Ava. <laughs> Keegan. And here will be our first round. Okay, Jeremy, your first question will be math questions. So that means each question you answer, you'll have 10 seconds. I'm going to be, an I'm gonna be asking you 5 questions. You can get a total of 10 points here. Are you ready? No. Okay. <laughs> okay, your first question will be, what is 10 times 7? 17. <laughs> Smart. Seventeen. Okay. Smart like that. You're so you better be joking. The, the answer is seventy. So that is two points missed out on. And smart? here will be your next question, Jeremy. Your next question will be. Okay, you ready? What is five times six? <laughs> Good job, Let's go. Kirby. He finally got one. <laughs> Are you gold? So your total points right now is two with three questions left. Okay, Jeremy, your next question will be: What is five times two? Uh, no, for it's ten. <laughs> Good job. That's four points with two questions left. Jeremy, your next question will be: Name seven times four. That was so close. Okay, Miss Allred, would you count that as points taken? Because you said it right as the timer went out. Sure, give him the points. All right, Let's go. that's six points with one question left. You have a chance to get eight points now. Do you think you're ready? Yes. All right, let's do it. Okay, Jeremy, your final question will be, what is nine times nine? Okay, Jeremy, your final points are six. That's three questions answered. And on to our next person. Ava, your question will be, you have 10 seconds. Your question will be, name as many NFL teams as you can in 10 seconds. Bro, that's messed up. I could have dominated that. Exactly. That's a plan. <laughs> okay. Your timer starts now. now. Cowboys, Browns, Raiders, Eagles, um, um, um. 49ers. Um, I don't know. <laughs> it's time though. Ava, your total points were 10. That's five questions answered. And on to our eighth grader, Keegan. Your question will be name as many juice brands as you can <laughs> in 10 seconds. Your timer I don't want one. starts now. I don't want to go. Good one. Watch this. That's it. That's all I know. I didn't lose. <laughs> <laughs> okay, since he only knows one, that's two points, one question answered. Keegan, that puts you with two, two points, one question answered. That puts you out. Jeremy, that's six points, you're out. Ava, with five questions answered, that's ten points, which Ava is our winner this week's game show. And we'll, we'll see, see you next week, Raptors. Raptors.